Hello knowledge seekers, this is Showman from Oil and Gas Field Quality Control. We are going through some topics to clear some of our basic funda. Today we will be discussing which one oil and gas engineer must know. Even the quality control inspectors and supervisors must have an idea. What are the types of valves generally used in oil and gas industry? and how the valves are being categorized based on their methods of opening or based on their applications or expected performance based on their functions or based on their connections type let us start what is a valve basically valves are referred to be those devices which are found controlling work regulating or directly flowing within a particular system or a process what are the main uses of valve? Proper functioning in starting or stopping a flow based on the valve state. Consistent regulating of flow and pressure within the piping system. It has a major role in controlling the direction of flow within a piping system. Throttling flow rates within a piping system helps in improving the safety through relieving pressure or vacuum in a piping system. Now the category of the valves or types of valves based on the methods of opening. It can be five types. Multi-turn valves. These valves are thought like a screw or piston. Crank the handle and the plug, plate, membrane or other controlling obstructions which moves into the path of the pipe blocking axis. It also depends on the valve which can have a higher or lower differentials that allows you in opening or closing them at verifying speeds. Quarter turn valves. Quarter turn valves are the types of valve which offer a complete range of motion in 90 degree turn of the handle. Means with 90 degree turn the valve closes and 90 degree turns back the valve to the closed position. Manual valves, as clearly predicted by the name, these valves are mostly the valves which are adjusted by hand. These are valves with huge hand wheels, hand levels, gear wheels or chains to actuate. Actuated valve, these type of valves are usually connected to the electrical motors, air or pneumatic systems, hydraulic systems or solenoids. These valves help in allowing the remote control and automation of the high accuracy or large scale applications. Automating valves. These are some valves which get activated only when there are a specific flow condition is met. For instance, it includes check valves, closing during the backflow of pressure release valves that gets activated when an overpressure condition is detected. Types of valve based on the application. Valves are found in very wide range with various characteristics, standards and groupings that help in giving you an idea about their applications and the expected performance. I am discussing here 12 types of valve for your information. Rotary valve. These valves are also referred to as a quarter turn valve that mostly relies on the rotary motion of the flow obstructor. In maximum cases, the rotation is limited to an angle of 90 degrees which makes it one quarter turn. Whereas, there are various other valves which can operate by the help of a larger degree of rotation that can have more than two positions in the regular operation. Valves which are truly quarter turn and found closing completely at an angle of 0 degree and completely opening at angle of 90 degree as an example, it is ball valves, plug valves. Linear valves. There are two different types of linear valves. First is multi-turn and another is axial. These two valves are found relying on the linear motion of the flow obstructor, whereas they are quite different in terms of construction and operation. Multi-turn rising stem valve. Multi-turn rising stem valves are those valves which move the obstructor by rotating a threaded rod also referred as stem which can be attached to the obstructor. 
these types of valve are mostly used for flow control application axial valve axial valves are those types of valve which use pneumatic and electromagnetic force in order to slide the obstructor along the axis. Coaxial valves, angle sheet valves are some of the examples of axial valves. These are the valves which are found acting first and only used for an on and off process. Actuated valve. Actuated valve is referred to as a component of a piping system which is mostly used in controlling the flow of the media through the system. The control is developed by manipulation some different types of obstructor within the valve. Actuated valves are those which use mechanical devices known as actuators that operate the valve by the help of a power source like the compressed air or electricity. Almost all the actuated valves are available in manually operated version or in an actuated valve accompanied with a manual override also. The most popular types of automated valves fall in one amongst these three main categories which are linear, rotary and self-actuated. In oil and gas field, generally abbreviated this actuated valve as MOV, GOV, HOV. As the name suggests, MOV is operated by electrical motors, GOV is operated by gas and HOV is operated by hydraulic or pneumatic pressure. Ball valve. These are referred to as those valves which are predominantly equipped with quick acting 90 degree turning handles. These are the valves which use a ball in order to control the flow and to provide an easy on off control. It is usually accepted by most of the operators to be faster and easier in order to operate as compared to the gate valves. Butterfly valve. The butterfly valve is designed in a very compact way with a quick acting rotary motion valve which is quite ideal for tight spaces. Butterfly valve bodies are found in various configurations. Knife gate valve. These are referred to as those valves which are used for controlling the flow of the media which containing solids. The knife gate valve features a quite thin gate which is controlled through the linear action that cuts through the materials and creates a seal. These valves are not that much suited for high pressure implementation while these valves are considered ideal for the use with grease, oils, paper pulp, slurry and wastewater which might obstruct the operation of other types of valve. Globe valve. Globe valves are referred to as those valves which are typically applied in modulating control operations. These are available in three body types, T body, Y pattern and angle body. Needle valve. Needle valves are mostly used in small diameter piping system where fine and accurate flow control is needed. The needle valves got its name from the point on a conical disc which is used within it. The last one in this category will be pinch valve. These valves are mostly used for handling solid materials, slurries and liquids with suspended solids. These valves are found using a linear motion and also feature an internal sleeve to isolate the media. Now types of valve based on their functions. As per common functional designation and design types, valve can be differentiated as isolation valve, regulatory valve, safety relief valves, non-returnable valves, special purpose valves. The first category isolation valves examples ball valve, butterfly valve, diaphragm valve, gate valve, pinch valve, piston and plug valves. Regulatory valve you can say also ball valve, butterfly valve, diaphragm valve, globe valve, needle valve, pinch valve and plug valves. Safety relief valves designed as pressure releasing and vacuum relief valves. Non-returnable valve, swing check and lift check valves. Special purpose valve mostly featured as multiport, float valve, foot and knife gate valve and line blind valve. The types of valve based on their end connection. It is flanged or threaded, we'll discuss. 
the implication of such valve and connection is due to the end connection compatible with the piping the types are screwed or threaded mostly used in the connection of an instrument or sample points flanged one of the most commonly used ends for piping butt welded widely used on high pressure and high temperature operations socket welded highly used in small bore piping where threaded connections are not permitted wafer and lug it is commonly used for compact valves installed in systems with limited space importance of selecting the valve material just i find this is important while discussing the valve the valve made of stainless steel are excellent option in a range of processing environment which also includes the corrosive media like chemicals salt water and acids with complete sanitation standards and processes by using a quite high pressure and high temperature other than this selecting a correct body material should be evaluated for the chemical compatibility which is of utmost importance finally i will just uh, name few standards the american society of mechanical engineers which is asmi american national standards institute ansi the manufacturer standardization society mss the international organization of standardization iso the public health and safety organization nsf nis international this is specially used for the corrosive services this requirement is important for the corrosive services sour gases as an example the american petroleum institute api for pipeline valves so that's all for the overview of uh, types of valve and their different categories hope this information will be useful for you please share and subscribe to my channel be with me signing off showman